Sinna ich Bia Achla na Lego Ach Asago DJ na Stoi Do Aschad Yegishta Hey Eyes von Kazuhira A message from the parasites Welcome back, boss. Ready for dispatch. Send me on a mission. Time for a mock battle, boss. Snake? Pass. That's right. It's her. What about the bomb? We were able to remove the explosives. Both of them. Bomb! No, no, no. No, it's okay. There's another in my... It's all right. We got it out. Make me proud. By the time they leave, I'll have the IAEA praising us as the poster boys for world peace. Out. Something's not right. Check her again.
It's okay. The other bomb, we managed it. She hit the water hard, but somehow she managed to survive. Anyway, the shock triggered some kind of amnesia. Snake, where's Professor Galvez? You mean... Yeah, she still thinks it's 1974. She's got no memory of anything before that either. Cypher, the KGB, nothing. It looks to be a kind of dissociative disorder. Dissociative amnesia, where memories are blocked out to protect the mind, and dissociative identity disorder, where the whole personality changes. What we're seeing seems to be a combination of the two. She truly believes she's nothing more than a student living in 1974. Peace day was a lot of fun. I hope we can do it again. She doesn't respond to anything that conflicts with her internal timeline. Doctor's pretty sure she's not faking it. If she had her memory, just think what she could tell us about Cypher. The photo was from that guy you brought back the other day. From the old crew. I thought it might jog her memory, but no luck. Anything else you can show her? Have something to show me, Snake? I give up. She's all yours. Something to show me, Snake? This photo. It is from the other day, right? I like it a lot. I look kind of silly, but it's got a peaceful feel to it. This day was a lot of fun. Everyone cheered at the end, even though I missed a few high notes. We should have more events like that, Snake. I'm sorry, Snake. My head hurts. Could you let me rest? The real me. I am...
Snake? Got something to show me, Snake? Remember Professor Galvez on his instrument during Peace Day? Woo -wee <laughs> Such a funny sound for a musical instrument. He said the Soviets invented it. Everyone sure seemed impressed. Music has no borders. The professor taught me that. Professor Galvez, anyway. I'm sorry, Snake. My head hurts. Could you let me rest? going to be a kind of festival held on Mother Base. They are calling it Peace Day. Snake and his men may be without a nation, but they are still an army, and that means sometimes they have to fight the bad guys. Of course, they should not fight at all. It is obvious to me that any problem can be solved with reasonable discussion. Maybe Snake and the others think so too, because the idea is to set aside war for one day a year and relax in peace. I do not know how it came about, but apparently Snake and Miller got the idea while they were talking, and everyone on Mother Base went along with it. To think that deep down... They ...a love of 
of peace. That makes me happy. But never mind that. Somehow, I have ended up singing on stage. Miller was all, Come on, both our names mean peace. It will be great. Why does that mean we have to be in a band? Then he roped Professor Galvez in too, saying, Hey, Galvez comes from peace too. We are the perfect act. I am not sure Miller... But then again, you always have to take Miller's talk with a grain of salt. What I cannot believe is, he went and told everyone we'd be performing together, without even asking my opinion. Now everyone thinks it has all been decided. I like to sing, but I have never had to perform in front of a crowd. I do not think I'm up to this. But everyone seems to be looking forward to it. I guess I would hate to let them down. And anything is better than letting Miller sing. <laughs> oh, that was mean. Miller said he was going to write a song for us. I wonder what it will be like. It is funny. The more nervous I get, the more I find myself looking forward to it.